Refman allows you to divide outcomes into subgroups. You can add these subgroups when you first create an outcome or add subgroups to an existing outcome. In the outline pane, right-click the headache outcome and select introduce subgroup. A subgroup will appear in the outline pane with the default name new subgroup. Right-click on the subgroup to rename it. Select Rename Subgroup. I'm going to rename mine as One Caffeine Dose. Click elsewhere to close the editing box. Alternatively, instead of using the right-click, you can use the Add Subgroup button on the toolbar. In the outline pane, I click on Headache again to add a second subgroup. This time, I'm going to use the Add Subgroup button on the toolbar. I'm going to rename this subgroup as Two Caffeine Doses. Click on Next. For my next action, I'm going to select Edit the new subgroup and click on Finish. You can copy and paste the study data between outcomes. In the outline pane, click the key icon to see the studies listed under one caffeine dose group. Select Adams 2001. Click the cut button on the toolbar. Go back to the outline pane and select two caffeine dose subgroup. To paste the data from Adams 2001 into this new subgroup, you can either go back to the toolbar and use the Paste button, or you can right-click and select Paste. Click the key icon next to Two Caffeine Dose group to see that the Adams 2001 study now appears under the new subgroup. If we move to the content pane, we will see that the study has also moved in the data table in the content pane, and the forest plot shows separate results for each subgroup. In some instances, you may not wish to calculate the combined summary statistics of the subgroups. For example, in the current outcome, we really want to keep the summary statistics of the two subgroups separate, so to switch off the total, Go back to the outline pane and select Headache Outcome. Go up to the toolbar and click the Properties button. In the Outcome Properties, select Analysis Detail. Under Totals, switch to Subtotals Only. And click on OK. The forest plot now includes two black diamonds showing the summary effect for each subgroup.